pretty early morning, but it is a really nice day. It actually feels just like summer. And here we are with the cars. And we are about to do some mods that we couldn't do the other day. These are the blue bars. Wish it was a little darker to match, but it's not too bad. I guess this is what 600 horse looks like. Supposedly, all I need to do is just unclip all of these and the grill should come right off. But I guess we'll see if it's actually that easy. One side is out and yeah, let's put the bar in. That's what the first one looks like. I think it's going to be pretty sweet. We'll see. I really wish it was a little darker though, but I think it'll do. I, could, I don't think I could find anyone that was darker blue than this. I think everybody's kind of selling the same ones. All right, got the grill in. Oh shit, maybe not. Now we are on to the next side. It hasn't been easy, but it's probably not that bad. Second one's out now. Now on for the last step. We're just putting the grill back in. Finally done. We definitely need to back it out to get a good look, but I think from what I could see, it's pretty sweet. Now that we've put the bars into the grill, we will be working on the next thing, which is the M5 emblem for the rear. It is in gloss black, as you guys saw. So I'm going to be installing that and that's pretty much it i don't think i actually have any other goodies in this bag i'm waiting for other things to arrive like my rear carbon spoiler i also have uh carbon uh, side mirror covers coming as well got my fishing wire got the emblem and yeah now i need to get in this little space or maybe even open the gate to get in there here we are in the garage I was going to see if I could get some tape out of here, but I'm not sure. I don't think I'll be able to, I'll need to move that. I don't know, I, I mean, the lighting's pretty bad, so you guys can't see that well, but I mean, I would have to move the box out of the way and whatnot. So yeah, maybe I'll go search for tape inside. I was like literally about to go through the window, forgot the doors here. So I'm so like, used to the door or so used to the window. We got it taped so i know exactly where it should go and yeah let's get to it all right got the five off i guess this is one piece so it shouldn't be too bad i guess it's time to get the cleaning this is the end product i think it looks pretty badass i would say yeah let me know what do you guys think I think it'll look pretty cool once that emblem is black and you know we got a little more going on with the carbon spoiler and the carbon roof spoiler back in the bmw m5 and just putting tissue box in here I'm not sure where the hell i should put it but i guess i could figure it out and yeah I'm pretty much heading inside after this and yeah that's pretty much where things will end I will be getting gas later but we'll just see uh, what time I go and how much it costs I do have about half a tank or a little lower so hopefully not too expensive in hopefully an upcoming video in the next several days my cousin and I will be going on a search for pretty much like a Hellcat interior for his Dodge Challenger in uh, peanut butter color he wants a peanut butter interior apparently uh, so we are going to be going on a search on that so we'll see how that goes i think that should be pretty fun uh, just chilling with him and going to these uh car lots uh trying to you know part out cars and whatnot and try to see if we could find any totaled uh hellcat uh, challenger that would have a peanut butter interior and as you guys would imagine, it's time for this gas station run. Heading out now. Actually, somewhat surprisingly, didn't think I was going to take the M5 out again today, but we are about to go grab some food. 
finally made it home and i guess i'll see you guys tomorrow but here we are days later and yeah the garage as you guys could tell the outside is still not finished because they have not come to work on it for i think three or four weeks now so unfortunately there has been no update with the garage and who knows when it will finally get completed got the spoiler here with me and it's time to unbox it i probably will be installing it tomorrow or at least i'll try to install it tomorrow but yeah just unboxing it today won't be installing it i mean i could do it hypothetically but i do have other things that i want to get done uh such as editing a ton of videos so uh you know installing it will be a project for the weekend it's a box inside of a box let's try to slide it out with one hand it looks as big as i wanted it to be but i guess we'll just see what the fitment is like first look and yeah it looks pretty legit i mean it's pretty long i think it'll be pretty similar to the one i had on the c63 i think it might actually be a tad bit bigger but the length looks almost the same i kind of like the carved out design over here where my finger's at so yeah i can't wait to put it on really nice day perfect day to work on the car even though i'm not actually going to be working on it 10 seconds later i'm really considering working on it now considering i wasn't even supposed to be out here and i am but i'm just gonna mock it up i think and head back inside i almost really want to put it on this is way too tempting right now but i think it's going to look pretty sick especially with a carbon roof and they have a very similar weave I guess this is going to be the resting place for the spoiler until I put it on but I'll probably get up even earlier than usual tomorrow so I could put it on uh, before I head out so we'll just see how that goes it shouldn't take too long to put on maybe an hour at most but I'm pretty sure I could probably do it and you know 30 to 45 minutes new package arrived and something tells me it's the carbon side mirror covers but we'll just see all right here we are with the box i really can't think of what else it could be it has a fragile sticker on it two hours later a lot of a lot of tissue in here 3m tape so i'm guessing it has to be side mirrors some tissue there some more tissue over here okay it just never ends doesn't it and here they are super lightweight as you guys would imagine It's actually crazy how light and thin it is pretty decent quality I would say I'm not really complaining I think there's a small smudge on here okay it's coming out so that's good but yeah so carbon as you guys could tell and the carbon actual uh, layout is exactly like the spoiler and it, i think it's pretty close if not exactly the same as the roof so pretty happy about it it will pretty much all match in terms of the carbon design that it has there's the other one and i guess i'll be wrapping it back uh, and installing it tomorrow so you guys will get to see that in the next part of this vlog uh, most likely and yeah this is the other part same thing pretty decent quality obviously very thin so I, you know it could easily break so definitely got to be careful with it but there we go